James Earl Jones, his most recognizable voice in the English-speaking language, who's, and he suffer, suffer, <laughs> suffers from stuttering. James Earl Jones calls it ironic because he makes an earning by talking. James Earl Jones experienced great loss in his life when he was young at the age of five and misses to beat when his parents abandoned him and his grandparents who enschooled them and he moved to Michigan and then they adopted him and this was very traumatic for Mr. Jones and he happened to stutter then stopped talking altogether he stopped talking for years he only developed his speech impediment when he was five but he continues to conquer it every day. He had to learn to push beyond his fears and overcome his stuttering. He chose the phase of ridicule. Yep, the kids in school mocked him, laughed at him. When we do nothing, we exchange fear for regret. Fear will fade in the face of a determined action. Since Mr. Jones spent most of his time in silence alone, he found a release in writing poetry. When he was in his first year of high school, his English teacher, Donald Krauser, or Crouch, encouraged him to speak. His English teacher forced him to read one poem aloud in front of the class each day. Mr. Crouch believes in him and encouraged James Earl Jones to face his fear and do it. He had a very difficult time at first, but held on and eventually it got easier. His stuttering got less and less. James Earl Jones to this day deals with his stuttering. He says, I'm mute, I cannot talk, but I've learned to get around those things that make me mute. I'm still a stutterer. He graduated from the University of Michigan. Mr. Jones has a long list of achievements in his acting career. His most famous voice tagline, this is CNN. He was the voice of Mufasa in The Lion King and of course Darth Vader in Star Wars. And let's see, he performed in Shakespeare on stage, acted in both movies and television. A few include A Field of Dreams, Cry for Beloved Country, Hunt for Red October, Clear, Present Danger. He is the most demanded voice in Hollywood and has two Tonys. He overcome fear, rejection, and abandonment, judgment, failure to become an inspiration and a famous actor. Yes. But he also, something's missing because he helped kids read. Oh, in addition to his encourage. In, or in addition to encouraging Mr. Jones to speak again, Mr. Couch was responsible for inspiring James to decide his personal time to promote education literacy with young people. Mr. Jones feels education is very important and has been honored for his work with the youths. So that is Mr. James Earl Jones, everybody. The greatest actor of all time. Who's in Lois and Clark?